guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 6 of The Maid I Hired Recently is Mysterious. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Y'all don't know how fucking tired I am. You don't. If you, if you follow me on Twitter, or if you follow me on Snapchat, oh, you see, you see, because the day, I mean, I've only been home now for like, a good what three hours and such and I'm still tired and I have to go back to work of course tomorrow um thank god I'm off Wednesday yeah Oh, that's so fucking cute. Shut up, Cody. I hope she didn't get stuck. Oh, okay, no, she made it home. Oh. That and maybe a bath, too. <laughs> I think she's getting a cold. Yeah, she's so getting sick. You can tell. Like, look how red her face is. Oh my. God. Yeah, go take a nice bath, lay down, get some soup, eat something. Mm. 
Well, look like the Aries don't have to take care of you. Oh my god, Lilith, you can't strain yourself. Oh. This will leave me with my fucking perfectionism and wanting to get things done and make it like nice and neat. Because that happened on Saturday. I had a customer get hella pissed at me because. I did something and yeah, I don't even want to talk about it. Let's just say I was close to cussing him out though, but I didn't. Your girl tried not to. Thank God it didn't happen. In my mind I did. <laughs> mm -mm, mm -mm. Just flash him. You know, he's right. Uh-oh. Are you getting sick now?
Mm-hmm. Oh. Sure, that's what she meant. I mean, the thing is, what do you want her to wear, though? <laughs> that, too. I don't know why. Well, no, I know exactly why. I read that as I'll dress up for you, and in my mind, I'm just fangirling. <laughs> uh, it's the damn show. Oh, it's so cute! Right? You can't have your like, cute little, like, fangirl moment right here and now. Oh, my God. Mm. Look at the cake. That looks so cute. See, this just is going to make me hungry. Like, come on now. The last thing I had was hot Pringles. And that was the scorching cheddar. Yeah, cheddar. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Look how cute she looks. Oh, my God. Stop it. Well, yeah, because your eyes. <laughs> oh, 
No, because it's Halloween. Halloween is the one day that you can dress up as whatever the heck you want. Mm-hmm. But something tells me she's going to use those photos for blackmail. Like... <laughs> Hmm? Are those the pictures? Ah! <laughs> oh, look at so cute. <laughs> the fuck was that? Well, whatever that is, it's not good, you know. What do the letters say, Lilith? I mean, he's gonna find out, so you might as well just tell him. And very... I think she has to leave you.
Ja. Oh. I was so good. Oh my god. I, I mean, you know what? Now I'm expecting who, whoever sent the letter, they're gonna show up by the end of the series. I mean, it's gonna be very similar to like season one of Kobayashi, where oh hey, look how cute and adorable this is, and then we get to the very last episode, and it gets hella dark and hella sad. And then, you know, once again, it's going to be Yuri proving his love for Lilith and being like, no, she's not going anywhere. She's staying with me. And that's it. I'm going to be over here in the corner crying my butt off and be like, oh my God, this is so freaking cute. I cannot, like, my babies. <laughs> it's too fucking mind I love it so much. Oh my God. Like, stop it. Please, like, no, but at the same time, give me more. I love it. <laughs> the Halloween costume party or, like, little, what, gathering? That was cute. Freaking cute. Everybody looked nice. Like, oh, my God. <laughs> it just makes me more excited for October because, yes, not only is that my birthday month, but that is truly when you are in, like, the balls deep of fucking Halloween celebration and stuff. And it's good. Even though, like, your girl... How many days into fall have we been in? Like, at least maybe four or five days. <laughs> and, okay, this is all, all right. Because, like, I said this in a text message talking to my two girlfriends. I was like, okay, so I've never tried, um, like, Starbucks pumpkin spice, like, frappuccino latte whatever or anything like one it's too hot here still in florida to have a latte because you know i'm already going to be sweating that heat off and such so i'm like because typically here it doesn't get cold until like a week after my birthday um i will always order you know cold drinks and then when we get into the cold that's when i'm gonna start ordering hot drinks if i ever really need a hot drink or if i just really want a spray i'm gonna order me a spray even though i really barely drink Sprite now, or really kind of soda in general. But I was like, yeah, I am one of them basic girls who was like, yes, I would like to have me a pumpkin spice latte. I want my room to look kind of like fall-ish and have fall decorations and stuff. But yeah, I want that pumpkin spice because pumpkin spice, I, I, I just like pumpkin. That's me. I just, it's something about pumpkin and, and like pumpkin pie is so freaking good that yeah, I was like, yeah, I'm basic. And my friend was like, Psh, you said it, not me. And I was like, yes, I know, I said it, but damn, let me speak. Because <laughs> it's full, you're supposed to have it. But like, oh, this is just so cute. It, it was, but you know, like I said, something just tells me that the organization that Lilith is a part of is definitely going to be even more on her butt as of right now. And we're probably going to see them 
by the end of this series. Like, like I said, we're getting all the cutesy Yushi, you know, cutesy Yushi, what the fuck, Deja? Cutesy, <laughs> cute shit. And then next thing you know, it's going to be like dark, sad, and a little depressing. But you know, it's okay. We got this. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction for you towards episode six of The Maid I Hired. <laughs> Absolutely is mysterious. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Metro Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all on Saturday when I get home for work for episode 7. Bye, guys.